If y'all are anything like me, you like to get the last word in, but you should be careful what you say, cause you never know when it's gonna be your last. Like these celebrities, their last words are etched into history for the rest of time. And some of their last words, well, they'll actually haunt you. Hey YouTube, welcome to the most amazing top five. My name is Amber Smith, sit back, subscribe, and let me entertain you. Now let's jump into our list with the top five last words of deceased celebrities. In the number five spot, we've got Whitney Houston, who was quoted saying, I'm gonna go see Jesus. I wanna go see Jesus. Now, Houston died in a bathtub on February 11th, 2012, from what appeared to be an accidental drowning in her hotel. The sad part is, is there were drugs presumably also involved. In the number four spot, we've got the king of pop, Michael Jackson. His eerie last words, get this, were more milk. Now, for all y'all that don't know what milk means, milk was the nickname he had given to the anesthetic called propofol, on which he actually overdosed. In the number three spot, we've got Ryan Dunn of Jackass fame. Ryan was a known party boy and lived a wild life with Bam Margera, Johnny Knoxville, and Steve-O. His last text read, Stopping for a beer, be there when I can. That was actually to co-star Bam Margera before his crash. Next up at number two, we have Heath Ledger, the most handsome heartthrob we all knew and loved, told his sister, Katie, Katie, look, it'll be fine. You know, I just need some sleep. Ledger had said this over the phone to his sister when he was anxious about not being able to sleep. He was telling her that he was going to take sleeping pills on top of prescriptions he had for a chest cold, and his sister warned him not to. Oh, that just makes me so sad and scared. Don't mix things like that guys, be careful. And finally in the number one spot we've got Coco Chanel and her creepy last words. They were, you see, this is how you die. She had gone for a long drive on the afternoon of Saturday, January 9th. Soon after, feeling ill, she went to bed early and uttered those words. She died on Sunday, January 10th, 1971 at the Hotel Ritz where she'd resided for more than 30 years. That's all I have for you folks for today. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. Wait, um, I, I don't want those to be my last words. Um, always smile, be kind, rewind. No, that's not good either. Um, whatever, bye.